This is the VOA Special English Health Report. Automatic faucets use an electronic sensor to start and stop the flow of water when people wash their hands. These faucets save a lot of water, which is one reason they are found in busy public bathrooms. Another reason is because of concerns about the spread of infection by people touching the handles on traditional faucets. Hospitals started using automatic faucets about 10 years ago. But a new study at one hospital finds that these devices may not always be worth the savings in water use. Researchers took apart 20 automatic faucets at Johns Hopkins Hospital in Baltimore, Maryland. They found that half contained Legionella bacteria, compared to 15 percent of manual faucets. Healthy people rarely get sick from the bacteria, so the study should not concern most users of automatic faucets in public bathrooms. But Legionella bacteria can cause a form of pneumonia in people with weakened immune systems. These include patients with diseases like cancer and HIV AIDS and those who have recently had an organ transplant. After their first tests, the researchers cleaned the water system with chlorine dioxide. But they found that 29 percent of the automatic faucets were still contaminated with bacteria. That compared to 7 percent of the manual faucets. The researchers have some theories. Dr. Emily Sidnor says the automatic faucets contain more parts. So there are more areas where bacteria could grow. Also, the reduced water pressure in low flow faucets might not remove as much bacteria from surfaces. She says the researchers think that the pieces and parts inside are providing places for bacteria to get trapped. That probably promotes something called biofilm formation, she says. And that, combined with the low water flow, is probably promoting the growth, she says. Six other studies have also found higher amounts of bacteria in automatic faucets. The latest study was presented in April at a meeting of the Society for Healthcare Epidemiology in Dallas, Texas. The study has not yet been published, but the results have persuaded Johns Hopkins Hospital to replace its automatic faucets with manual ones. The Chicago Faucet Company supplies the hospital with automatic and manual faucets. Patrick Kiminer is the senior vice president of sales. He says the 110-year-old company has been a long-term supplier for a lot of healthcare facilities in the United States. He said he had not seen the full study, but we're more than interested to find out what those findings would be. For VOA Special English, I'm Carolyn Pursuti. For more ways to learn American English and stay informed every day, Go to voaspecialenglish.com from your computer or mobile device.